Welcome back once again. In this part, we will design our activity home layout where we will add our navigation drawer. So open this activity home layout and remove this constant layout and add navigation drawer. So we need to add a drawer layout. And we need to define an ID. We can call it ID Drawer Layout and add Fit System Window True and Tools Open Drawer is a Start. We need to add this line of code. Okay, so we added our ID fit system service window and open drawer. Now include. So now we need to include our app bar layout. So layout and include this app bar layout. And select layout white mesh parent. And a layout height, mass parent, and now we need to add our navigation view. So add navigation view, layout white, wrap content, and height, mass parent. Now add Now we need to add Android Layout Gravity Center Not center, we need to add Layout Gravity Start and define a id we can call it id nav view and add fit system windows true And add item text appearance, and we can uh, we can add text appearance medium, or we can add text appearance small. Now we need to add icon. So app item icon tint and we need to choose and we can choose nav header color or toolbar color. Okay, toolbar color. So we just add item icon tint and item text appearance. That is just a design issue. And now we need to add. So in this home layout, we added our drawer layout and navigation drawer. Now we need to create a new menu for our navigation view. So create a new menu for menu file and we can call it nav menu. 
and inside this menu folder we need same item so we can call it item id dashboard and add title we can call it dashboard and add a icon so we can call it android icon dashboard and add a item and define a id and we can call it id income and add a title and we can call it income and for icon is going to be income and android id is going to be expense and this title is going to be expense and this icon is going to be expense so we added three item and now we need to add our menu so app menu and we can call it nav menu so menu nav menu so now we can see our menu item inside our navigation view and in here we need to add a header layout and header layout is going to be nav header and now we can see our nav header and our navigation view so we successfully design our navigation drawer and in our next part we will start working for more functionality